Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm here to make a Doctor Who for Dummies video. Now, this is going to be a video about the uh, popular sci-fi British show called Doctor Who. If you don't know what Doctor Who is, that's what I'm here to help you with. Because uh, Doctor Who will be having its 50th anniversary. Yeah, amazing. Uh, it's been running since 1963. And the 50th anniversary is coming up this fall, uh, November 23rd. So I'm going to try to convince you to become a Doctor Who fan so you can watch the 50th anniversary. So it can become huge. Alright, so let's get started, shall we? Doctor Who ran from 1963 to, to 1989, then it stopped, then it returned in a movie in 1996. And that was just it, where we were introduced to the 8th Doctor. Uh, he was only in the movie, and then that stopped and it returned in 2005 and it has been running ever since. And there has been 11 Doctors, and they are... William Hartnell, Patrick Photon, John Peardwee, Tom Baker, Peter Davison, Colin Baker, Sylvester McCoy, Paul McGann, Christopher Gleston, David Tennant, and Matt Smith. Okay, so let me give you a few facts about the Doctor. His name is The Doctor, not Doctor Who, The Doctor. He's a 950-year-old Time Lord from the planet of Gallifrey. He stole a machine called the TARDIS, which stands for Time and Relative Dimension in Space, and traveled. The Doctor's race, the Time Lords, are all dead. They died in a big time war against the Daleks, where both the Time Lords and the Daleks were extinguished. Uh, but for some reason, the Daleks keep appearing in Doctor Who. The Doctor always has a companion and is always a beautiful girl. And the Doctor is somewhat always a handsome man which is basically the producer's way of both having an appeal to women and to men. The reason why there has been so many doctors is because the doctor regenerates, which basically means that he changes all his cells in his body, so basically becomes a new person. And this is just the producer's way of keeping the show young and fresh. And so forth, the doctors has become younger and younger and younger. Uh, so we'll see how young the next doctor is. In the start of June, it was released that Matt Smith, who plays the 11th Doctor, the, uh, the newest Doctor, was going to regenerate in the Christmas special. So we'll see who comes up. And it was also released that John Hurt will be playing the Doctor for the 50th anniversary. The Doctor has a lot of enemies. The prime ones, though, are the Daleks, the Cybermen, and the Suntarans. But there's a lot of other enemies for the Doctor as well. In the fourth season from 2009, we first heard about the organization called Torchwood. Torchwood is a play on words, which actually means Doctor Who, if you twist them. And Torchwood has actually become its own Doctor Who spin-off series. The longest companion of the Doctor was a girl named Sarah Jane Smith. And Sarah Jane Smith has actually come back uh, from the show started in 2005. She has come back. Sadly, she died in 2011, but she got her own series called The Sarah Jane Adventures, uh, which is basically about her life. Alright, that was all I had to say about Doctor Who. I hope you will tune in for the 50th anniversary. And I know I'm really excited about it. So, yeah. Be sure to like and subscribe and do all that stuff. And I'll see you next time. Bye.